Good to see you, Namrut. Nefertari sent reinforcements, I see. His name is Bayek, a dear friend of Nefertari's. I've asked him to come along and he graciously accepted. I suppose we all do. I hear you are in some trouble. I owe a favor to Nefertari. If it's as you say, follow me and stay close. <laughs> the path to the mine was clear, but that doesn't mean it will be on the way back. Be ready for anything. You seem uneasy, Namrut. Why the hesitance? I don't like straying from the plan. These lands are teeming with dangers. Bandits, soldiers, the wild. It's why we make the trips at night. Helps avoid our point of retreat. Retreat from what? An attack on a nearby encampment. There were more soldiers than we thought. Lost a lot of good men. How many wounded? Enough. That's why being close to their mine is so important. That was close. Let's move. Enough. That's why being close to their mine is so important. The healers work wonders. We are lucky Nefertari allows these deals. She has a pure heart, risks her neck. The mine belongs to the regime, after all. We should be out of harm's way once we cross that bridge. This is it. When we get inside, I will need your help to tend to the wounded while Sufia prepares the natron. I pray we have not lost more men. I will set up. Bayek, follow Namrut. He will show you what to do. These men, move them to the rear, by the kilns. This way, we will line them up. It will be easier for Sufia. The band is much smaller than I imagined. Small, but united. We fight for one another. I am merely one of them, spared by the gods this time. Cold. I am so cold. <coughs> Their wounds are severe. But they'll live if Sufia is anything like Nefertari. You and Nefertari are old friends. Something like that. She saved my life after I killed Rujek. You are the one that killed Rujek, huh? I cannot believe it. By the gods, the brazier, the fire will alert the regime. Spread out. They have found us. Rebels, move in. Leave none alive. Archers, ready your arrows! Kill the wounded last! It is useless to fight! You are outmatched! Lay down your weapons, and we will make it quick! I would rather stick my sword down your throat! Those who oppose Ptolemy's reign, die! Those who fight me, die! This one fights alongside these rebels! A fool's choice! You shit! Die! It 
with Sufia. She lit the brazier. Why would she draw the soldiers to us? I will go check on the others. Go do something about Sufia. Back off! You are a murderer! Talk! The omens! It was you! Why? You check? I loved him! He promised me a better life! You took him from me! Now I see. You're Rujek's mistress! Well, your fucking lava killed my son! I feel nothing for you! You are meant to die! Ah! What a shame. Such a pretty girl. There's no room for pretty in our war. Death drives us to do things we regret. She tricked us both. Your men? The pile of dead gets bigger. We will treat the survivors. No time to fetch another healer. We have the Natron, at least. We will do what we can. Jexaro. I marked his name off my list with this. Now it sits on the ground, forgotten. Someone has sealed this room. The smell of the blood I spilled still lingers here. Mummified Heron. For resurrection? No. Whoever did this must have known of Rudjek's place in the Order. Rudjek does not deserve a tomb. But this is an insult. This tomb was made for a pharaoh. Whoever did this has defiled this place. mask. I barely remember what happened after I stabbed him. This room has told me all I need to know. This place was a beginning for me and an end for Rujek. The arrow marked both of those things. After I stabbed that bastard, things went dark. When I came back to myself, Rujek was dead. Rujek's body should have been left to rot. He has been laid to rest with respect by someone who wanted him to enter the Duat prepared. Whoever buried him also left this heron mummy to honor Rujek with his god's damned namesake in the afterlife. They then returned here to pay respect to Rujek. If these candles are any indication. No matter what, I know Rujek's heart was found lacking. That bastard suffers in the afterlife, no matter what was done here. For him. 
Rudrick's mistress, Sophia, seems the likely culprit. It is misguided, but she has been dedicated. I will be judged one day, but I do not regret my actions. The feather will always be lighter than my heart.